color. I thought that Martin Luther King said the color wasn't the, wasn't the issue. I thought it was the content of our character that we were supposed to be um, recognized for. But if she's going to keep running on that color, she's going to have a misconception about how black people really wrong. If you bring somebody into office that looks like you, but then continues to detriment your community, what was that for? But if you choose somebody who can raise your community, then you chose the right one. Yes. So, who do you choose? Personally, I choose Trump. I'm looking for who I think is more qualified to run the country. That's all, that's all I'm looking at. Black Latinos are starting to be a little bit more critical. They're fed up of their uh, hard-earned money going to illegal, undocumented people. Kamala Harris did not do a good job on the border because from what I know, a lot of people were coming from the other side and doing a lot of bad things to what we call home. I think she's not a good candidate for president because she's with Joe Biden for the past two years, a wreck up of New York, you know. Colors don't matter, man. Right, they don't. Ask God, man. That's true. So what do you think about all candidates that uses their race as a selling point? Do you think yeah, that's, that's some weird that's you lost. You lost already. 2024. If you racist today, you lost. Nobody going against Trump. It's not about race. It's about what they provide for the society. Is what they could do for the community. With her putting a lot of black Americans in jail for the marijuana, they're not really going for her. We also got people's thoughts on Trump's recent comments on Harris's ethnicity. She was only promoting Indian heritage. I didn't know she was black until a number of years ago when she happened to turn black and now she wants to be known as black. Yeah, she was Hindu when it suited her purpose, you know, and now that she's running, the black vote suits her purpose. So, like Trump said, you know, now she's black. Donald Trump is absolutely right. Her mother is Indian, her father is Irish Hindu, and she's always uh, presented herself as uh, as Indian. What do you think about uh, Trump saying Kamala Harris is black? I thought she was Indian. She was saying she was Indian. <laughs> That's my response. He's a Trump is an open book, yo. Facts. That's just Trump being Trump. I don't I don't believe he, he's racist. I don't even think he has a racist bone in his body. And Trump said that uh, Kamala Harris always portrayed herself to be Indian, and now all of a sudden she's saying she's black. Right? Nah, she's really Indian. She just want our support. She's trying to snatch our support away from Trump, but that's not how that's going down.
why are y'all voting for Kamala Harris? I don't want to lose my rights. Like, I'm a trans man and I'm gay and I have been pregnant and I've had an abortion before and I don't want to lose that. I'm afraid of not being able to be myself anymore because from what I've heard, Trump's America doesn't want me to look like this. So that's why I'm here today and that's why I'm voting blue. What about you? Um, I've also been pregnant and had an abortion before. I was a minor and it would have been dangerous for me to properly, like it would have been dangerous for me to carry a baby with like personal reasons and everything. Um, I also like, I'm very, you know, Alternative. Alternative, and I feel like if Trump were to win, I wouldn't be able to, like, express myself through my looks and everything, and wouldn't be able to have the piercings or the dyed hair or the tattoos that I want, you know. I would be able to be myself, and um, my dad's very pro-Trump, and I'm just very... Pro-Kamala. <laughs> yeah. Pro-Kamala, yeah. I don't, you know... It's just, Does that cause a divide at all? Yeah, it definitely does. He thinks that uh, Kamala's going to ruin the country, but I think that Trump would do worse, like, a lot. Like, Kamala is going to be good for the country.